Hi, Marshy here. Now, I've done a few fishing shows in the past myself, and I know how hard it can be, setting it all up and all that TV stuff. But what you're about to see is two people, a camera, and a huge sense of adventure and spirit. These guys just got up and went fishing. Not to show you how it's done like all those other TV shows, but to share their experiences of how they did it. They didn't even have all that fancy fishing gear either. They just were normal people doing it on their own. They asked local advice and left all those normal things in that you and I know what happens on a fishing trip. So sit back, relax, and let's see some fish out of water. Right now, it's really turning it on. I've got a loose lure line out there, so I've got to keep it away from the airport hand. Ah, just a little macky. Trying to control the fish so I can get it in without bruising him and hurting him too much. So I can let go. We've got two mackerel and there's plenty. So we just want to do fun now. Right to help you? one way of releasing them, but it's an expensive way of doing it. An eight dollar lure gone at the door. That's the way fishing is. Had a sensational day of fishing out here, about eight and a half nautical miles off room. Uh, we've got into some cobia, shark, snapper, uh, been reefed by some monstrous fish, and uh, just got a couple of lines out trolling, hopefully pick up maybe a mackerel or a chinner on our way back. And uh, just gonna sit in close, get some garfish for um, hopefully get out tomorrow for some selfish. So uh, until then, catch up. Launching your boat off the beach in Broome is really easy, as the sand is rock hard. But a tip here is to do it all in one go, as the tides come in very quickly. I've seen cars get lost as the tides come in, because they aren't quick enough. And that'll ruin your day for sure.
selfish and imbrued is probably in a class of its own. You don't need a big boat and all that expensive gear to do it, as the fish are quite close in. The locals do it in 14-foot tinnies. Now that's out of four. Good morning, just in case you're unaware, we are about uh, 32 k's north of Broome. A small flotilla of uh, tinnies, all about five metres and under. And we are catching sailfish, hopefully. We've been dragging our teeth and the boards and the baits for about an hour and a half. No joy yet. But this is real water fishing, it's uh, a vacation's game. And uh, we hope everything goes all right. You just don't know what's out there. In the States, some of the guys put speakers on the bottom of their boats and play diesel engine sounds to raise the fish. It's said to attract the fish to the boat. But honestly, if they're there and you're there, well, you know the rest.